Hello, how are you? It's Diane Banks, voice actress, radio personality, and Disney fan in Chicago. Hope you'll subscribe. Just click the red button. And my other videos, all 300, are waiting for you, including Disney Magic Kingdom's The Rocket Ralph uh, uh, event game that you can see this thumbnail here. And if you want to check out the rest of my 300 videos, you'll be my new best bud. <laughs> We're going to talk about uh, Bow today, and it's pretty exciting. Not only was it nominated for an Oscar, but um, maybe you had a chance to catch it online. Disney Pixar released it online for a week so we could see it or see it again uh, in honor of the animation uh, nomination. So that was pretty exciting. But also the director released some things that we haven't seen before. Some deleted scenes and sketches and such. So I thought I would share those with you today. Uh, one of the coolest ones, um, well they all look pretty good actually, was this I thought. It looks like they were trying to give us a sense of her background, uh, but we didn't see this in the movie. So she's out with friends, and I guess, you know, when you've got a seven-minute short, you got to cut a lot of stuff. So, <laughs> so um, I just thought that was pretty neat. And then this one, something similar does show up in the movie just in terms of location like on the train or the bus or wherever they are but again here it's she's with one of her friends but instead the scene turns into something which is more applicable to again the direct action of the movie because you've only got seven minutes she said she wished it was longer i don't blame her she she wanted to turn it into a, like a 30 minute thing uh, maybe she will one day but i thought this part from the movie in comparison to what the uh deleted uh, sketches concept um, was was comparable because she's got the bags of groceries and there they are and of course we remember this being the scene where the little guy's mad at her because she wouldn't let him run off with the soccer players um, I just think this is one of the best Pixar shorts both in terms of story and animation it was really wonderful and I'd love to know in the comments what you thought about it um, if you enjoyed it as much as I did so here's another one. Now this again, it looks like it was it was meant to show background about her life, but when you've only got seven minutes, you got to cut things. So this got cut uh, the cutting room floor as well. But there she is. I'm assuming that was her husband, and they're out in nature somewhere taking some photos. This one. Um, now this one we do get a sense of this in the movie. Again, this scene's a little bit different. You don't see the people flipping out. I don't think. I remember that, them flipping out so much, but um, let me grab the shot. Here it is. So we do get, now I'm going to scooch it over here. Whoops. Let's see if we can get this to line up here. Um, so we do get a sense from the movie you know of the same kind of feeling for the scene yeah I don't see there wasn't a bunch of people running around here but there she is with the bags and then they changed it here where she's running she got one bag and then she's running after her little dude who again was running off with those soccer play he loves the soccer players you can't blame them they were having a good time <laughs> okay so there was that one um, and then she released a few more for us too. I just thought I, I love the, the things we never get to see, you know, and I'm sure you do too. So here's another moment. Now this was in the living room, and again they changed it probably in the interest of time. Um, and the concept that we got that was similar for the movie, you can see here that they actually changed it. So there's still, we get the TV set over here. Now instead of her crying, she's preparing the meal and her husband's watching the TV over here as she gives him his food before he heads off to work. Uh, I'll make that a little bigger. But you can, you can see it's kind of the same concept except they changed it to the kitchen. Again, probably in the interest of time. And then there, there she is. It looks like watching soap operas. Isn't that cute? And she's making, uh, looks like maybe cutting some beans or something here. And in this scene, which was in the movie, she's already got the dumplings made. But, you know, we get to see the, uh, the process here, which is pretty cool. And then this one, it looks like she's at the bus stop, maybe enjoying some kind of snack or something. Um, I don't know, and again, I'm sure in the interest of time, it was like, well, what does this have to do with the the film itself? And then 
this part I found that was in the movie that, you know, kind of similar. So maybe they took that concept and moved it into the scene with her and the little, little bow dude. Remember this part, his little head flattened and she had to give him something to eat to get his head to sit up again. <laughs> but so there's that, um, how the concept changed. Look at all their little spices. So cute. I just loved it. Coco, oh, Choco Locos or something up here. Um, okay. So then there's another piece of concept. We saw that. Um, and then these are just some other scenes. These were actually in the movie. I'm always look, looking for hidden Mickeys and things if I can find them for us. I'm, I'm sure you are too. If you saw any hidden Mickeys, please let me know in the comments. I thought this was so cute when she's measuring his little head. And then when he becomes an obnoxious teen eating his shrimp chips. Is that really a thing? Shrimp chips? Um... Please share if you know. I love this shot, too. This is our director. Do, is it Demi Shai or Demi Shi? I, I don't know if I'm saying that right. But I love this because she's got her dumpling. It looks like a puppet almost, doesn't it? Uh, definitely animated. And I'm sure that was part of the process. And then here's another piece of concept art. Lovely. Remember the part when she's carrying the baby close? And he claps his little hands when he sees, I think, some of the vegetables or something that she was preparing. And these are from her own sketchbook when she was making uh, the recipe and things for the movie and writing down notes. And I love this. Uh, so they had this on Twitter, I think, some of this. Hi, Mom, I'm going to do an illustrated recipe guide for your bow. Can you give me the recipe? To me, yes. First, you take a handful of a handful of flour, a bit of yeast, some water. Hold on, how many cups is a handful? What's a cup? <laughs> and her little expression here. Isn't that cute? And then this is part of the process. Step three, let the dough rise for about two hours. Sleepy little dough boy. Uh, and then this shows the kneading process. I love her sketches, her animation. Bring a pot of water to a boil. Place the bow in a steamy basket lined with cabbage leaves to prevent sticking. Place the basket on top of the boiling water. Close lid. Steam 15 minutes. Turn off the heat. Blah, blah, blah. But you know what? Actually, I found uh, step 10. Eat or adopt as your surrogate child. Oh, she's eating the dough, the bow. Um, oh, yeah, and somebody posted this, too. Isn't this cool? Her grandma made... The dumplings, just like uh, Demi's mother did. Isn't that beautiful? That's really an art form, isn't it? Those are gorgeous. Too, almost too pretty to eat. And just some artwork I did for the last video. Which, by the way, thanks, you guys. You made that my most watched video of uh, 2018. So that rocks. I appreciate that. Um, but what I was going to share here is that I found the recipe. And I'll put this under the video for you. This includes what we just looked at. This was on Eater, so thanks for that to them. But here it is, part we just looked at. But here's the whole recipe. If you actually want to make these, the filling and everything. So isn't that nice of her mom to share that? And here's all the steps. Some of those we just looked at. Look how cute this is. Cabbage, carrot, onion, ground ginger, sesame oil, olive oil. Ooh, that looks good. And then there's the process we saw. The kneading the dough making the little dumplings and you remember she did that in the movie too that process was there and there's bow appetit illustrations by Demi our, our director so there you go and uh, just to wrap up here I found this on the Disney website if you're a, a bow fan and you want a shirt look how cute that is big sale too I'll put the link for you and 20 bucks down from 34.95 now, this was on Twitter. If the shirt actually did this, I would buy it right now. Isn't that cute? The way they animated the shirt. Oh, I love that. So, there's that. Let me know in the comments what you think of the movie and the concept art and anything else you want to talk about Disney related. And a quick shout out to our friends at uh, Instagram. You can follow me there at banks.diane. Uh, on my happy holidays here. Brother Store Pescara says, passing by for a wave. Have a good day. Thanks, you too. And then a quickie here, my Macy's Chicago Christmas window behind the scenes. If you want to check out that video, please do here on YouTube. And over on Instagram, Mr. Lincoln Imaging says, great picture. Thanks for sharing. So thanks, you guys. As always, don't forget to please subscribe. 
Give me your thoughts on Bao and our lovely artwork and deleted scenes. It's Diane Banks. Please subscribe. Thanks as always for watching and we'll talk soon.